It is June 13th, Friends for Life Day, so remind your friends about the importance of breast health and breast cancer awareness. When a Grand Rapids woman was diagnosed with breast cancer in September of 2012, she not only drew from her strength, but also from her creativity. And now, almost four years later, that creativity has led her life down a path she never imagined. When they told me that I had breast cancer, I didn't believe it. I'm like, where's the lump? You know, I didn't feel anything. I didn't feel any different. I didn't feel sick. Um, but it was something that showed up um, during my mammogram. Danny Redwine has a family history of breast cancer, which is why she started getting her mammograms early. At the age of 38, she opted for a mastectomy of her left breast and the long process of reconstruction. That was a very uncomfortable process. There's a lot of pressure on the chest, and um, I kind of took a T-shirt and kind of stuck it in between my seatbelt and my chest. And that's how her invention, the cushy, was born. She submitted her idea to Grand Rapids Start Garden and was awarded seed money to help other breast cancer survivors. The cushy cushioned me. It was my motivation. You know, I, I really feel like as much as I put thought about this being a product for other people, this product was for me. But when the money for the cushy ran out, she remembered the resolution she made when she was first diagnosed. I had the choice to either be sad or stand up and deal with it. <laughs> but um, it's all good. I um, And stand up, with, she did, uh, as in comedy. Always wanted to do stand up comedy. Her first gig was at Sunday Night Funnies two years ago on Grand Rapids. And I wrote it out and I practiced and I got up there and did a five minute set about being a breast cancer survivor. And that was the beginning of the next adventure. She's done shows all over the Midwest and continues to perform regularly in Grand Rapids on Sunday nights. I talk about, you know, the boob um, and having a new one and having an old one. You know, I've got Pamela, Margaret, you know, so, it's, <laughs> you know, I just I just kind of I just kind of make light of, of some of the dark things I've gone through. But Danny has a serious message for African-American women. She works with Coleman, Michigan, and the local group Got Faith to raise awareness about breast cancer in the African-American community. We are the ones that are perishing, you know, from this disease. So, you know, it's kind of an awareness thing. Like, hey, you know, get your, check yourself out. And she plans to continue to raise awareness through her comedy. As long as I have the support and the love, I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing, making people laugh. Oh, she's such a great lady, and she still hasn't given up on the cushy. She's hoping to find an investor so mm -hmm. that she can resume production. Now, her next comedy performance, Sunday night in Grand Rapids, and you can find more information on her Facebook, and you'll find that information on the story on our website, WZZM13.com. Fantastic example, not just for breast cancer survivors, for anyone. What an inspiration. I just loved getting to know her.